That went better than I anticipated. I'm surprised uh, he didn't realize who gave us, uh, who told us about it, because I'm wearing, you know, their armor, or signature armor. I also have their signature blade at my hip. At my hip. You think he'd go, huh? That armor looks very familiar. So is that type of sword. Oh, you bastard. Or bitch. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, perfect. We have a blizzard going on, too. Well, it's a light snow, I should say. Not a blizzard. Off this armor. Come on. Hurry. Oh, boy. To Parthenax lies through this gate. I will show you how to open the way. That hurt. I've seen a lot of pyres, and I've never actually seen them actually hurt me, so that was kind of interesting. Look. Look. Grant you my understanding of clear skies. This is your final gift from us, Dragonborn. Use it well. All right. Luckily, we don't have to go out and slay through dragons just so we can this one. He gives us the ability to. Now, clear skies can be used for a multitude of things. The most obvious is. Uh, this one. Uh, Skyrim itself yields before the thum as you clear away fog in and inclement weather. Okay. Clear skies will blow away the mist, but only for a time. Basically, if it's uh, snowing like this, you can use uh, uh, you can use the shout to uh, get rid of it. Uh, I believe you can even use to clear cloudy skies. If not, the name is kind of ironic. Um. Do when it's raining as well. Basically, if you're having trouble seeing because of the weather, just go. Look, cool. You're good. It also works on uh, that type of stuff too. Luckily, though, once we uh, get up here, we don't have to worry about it anymore because, well, we can fast travel to the top. Yeah, there's a clear sky. I think I have to use it multiple times to clear the sky out properly, though. Oh. Look! Hello, goat. The hell? Look! Oh, something I could hit me or something. Uh. I'm okay. Whoa. That's, uh, disorienting. Uh -huh. Kind of like, uh, what you doing there, buddy? Have a nice, uh, Aurora tonight. No? Uh, the shout can also be used as a stun for uh, some enemies. It basically acts, acts like the, I think, the first or second level of uh, Unrelenting Force.
this uh miss so I don't fall off the edge. Fall off this I would kill ya. No. Oh, depends what's underneath ya. Alright. Okay. Make sure I was recording, because uh had a little scare there. Far away for it to matter to me right now. No. It's weird how I stumble whenever I use it like that. Ooh. Throw the world. Now you can actually come up here using um, the horse trick, where horses can pretty much defy gravity. But, uh, you won't meet Parthenax up here. At that point. Drem Yolok, greetings, Wundunik. I am Parthenax. Who are you? What brings you to my Strulmach, my mountain? They see me as master, Wuth Onik, old and wise. It is true I am old. Tell me, why do you come here, Volan? Why do you intrude on my meditation? Hmm. Drem, patience. There are formalities which must be observed at the first meeting of two of the Dove. By long tradition, the Elder speaks first. Hear my Thum. Feel it in your bones. Match it if you are Dovahkiin. I don't have the last word for it, so. Understand fire as the dove do. Uh, the last one is in Thunderstone Gorge. Uh, I was going to get it before coming here, but I forgot. <laughs> uh, plus, it would have taken me a little, a little bit more time to get through all of it. Be afraid, Fasnu. Let me feel the power of your thum. Your thum. Ah, I have expected you, Proda. You would not come all this way for Tinvak with an old Dova. No. You seek your weapon against Alduin. Mm, yes, they are very protective of me, Bachlan Fadon. But I do not know the Thum you seek. Croesus, it cannot be known to me. Your kind, Jor, mortals, created it as a weapon against the Dove, the dragons. Our Hadrime, our minds, cannot even comprehend its concepts. Drem, all in good time. First, a question for you. Why do you want to learn this Thum?
Ruza. As good a reason as any. There are many who feel as you do, although not all. Some would say that all things must end, so that the next can come to pass. Perhaps this world is simply the egg of the next Kalpa, Lean Vokin? Would you stop the next world from being born? Paz, a fair answer. Rofus, maybe you only balance the forces that work to quicken the end of this world. Even we who ride the currents of time cannot see past time's end. Ulsetid los trahodis. Those who try to hasten the end may delay it. Those who work to delay the end may bring it closer. But you have indulged my weakness for speech long enough. Croesus. Now, I will answer your question. Hmm. Do you know why I live here, at the peak of the Monavin, what you name Throat of the World? Hmm, true, but few now remember that this was the very spot where Alduin was defeated by the ancient tongues. Varucht Unslad. Perhaps none but me now remember how he was defeated. Hmm, yes and no. Viknus Nikaron. Alduin was not truly defeated either. If he was, you would not be here today seeking to defeat him. The Nords of those days used the Dragonrend shout to cripple Alduin, but this was not enough. Ok Mulag Unslad. It was the Kel, the Elder Scroll. They used it to cast him adrift on the currents of time. Not intentionally. Some hoped he would be gone forever, forever lost. Maye. I knew better. Tidbo Amativ. Time flows ever onward. One day he would surface. Which is why I have lived here. For thousands of mortal years, I have waited. I knew where he would emerge, but not when. Tid Krent. Time was shattered here because of what the ancient Nords did to Alduin. If you brought that Kel, that Elder Scroll, back here to the Tid Ahran, the Time Wound, with the Elder Scroll that was used to break time, you may be able to cast yourself back to the other end of the break. You could learn Dragonrend from those who created it. You have it. The Kel. The Elder Scroll. Tidkrech Kalos. Time shudders at its touch. There is no question. You are doom-driven. Kogan Akatosh. 
The very bones of the Earth are at your disposal. Go then, fulfill your destiny. Take the scroll to the Time Wound. Do not delay. Alduin will be coming. He cannot miss the signs. Yeah, I got the uh, Elder Scroll quite a while ago. Uh, before we do that, though, I'm going to show you something interesting. Let's climb all the way up here. To the very peak of the uh, mountain. Our last uh, weapon enchantment is up here. <laughs> Come on. Come on. This is the notched pickaxe. Now there are two uh, possible references that are being here. The most popular is the, is the most obvious one. It's the um, uh, notch from the, the creator of Minecraft. The most prominent tool of which is the pickaxe. So notched pickaxe. It also comes with the enchantment notched pickaxe, which raises raises uh, wielders smithing abilities and does five shock damage. The uh, smithing could be a reference to the crafting of the game as well. There's another uh, theory running, uh, roaming around that could be a reference to uh, the pickaxe found at the summit of uh, Mount Everest. It was uh, placed into the mountain similar to that, like how we just found it. Again, this is just a rumor though. Uh, no one really knows which one they're referencing. It could probably be a Minecraft due to the fact that there was a dispute going on about... Um, Minecraft's game scrolls and Bethesda's Elder Scrolls. There was a, a lot going on back then. Anyway, enough of that. There are also a few ebony veins up here as well if you need it. Yeah, Malkite ore. Alright, down we go. That, by the way, up there is the highest point in Skyrim. Other than um, when Meridia takes you up. Let's see if we can talk to him and get another thing done. You have it. The Kel. The Elder Scroll. You can actually see it very easily. Very easily where it's at in the Time Star. Time shudders at its touch. Yeah, it's very easy to see. Alright, we need to use the Elder Scroll Dragon. Um, if you haven't got it yet, you'll go on a quest to talk to... Uh, uh, Septimus Cygnus. You'll do a quest for him, doing the tran uh, transferring the... Uh, Discerning the Trans Mundane, which will take you to, uh, Alfred? Alfred, yeah. Uh, in there you'll find the Elder Scroll. Ooh, quick. Alright, let's read it. Our last Elder Scroll. Dragon. Jim, you are doom-driven. Kogan Akatosh. <laughs> Today, Alduin's lordship will be restored. But I honor your courage. Creek Wolf Akrin, die now in vain.
glorious day, is it not? Have you no thought beyond the blooding of your blade? <laughs> what else is there? The battle below goes ill. If Aldun does not rise to our challenge, I fear all may be lost. You worry too much, brother. Victory will be ours. Why does Alduin hang back? We've staked everything on this plan of yours. He will come. He cannot ignore our defiance. And why should he fear us, even now? We blooded him well. Four of his kin have fallen to my blade alone this day. But none have yet stood against Alduin himself. Both Sori, Birkar. They did not have Dragonland. Once we bring him down, I promise, I will have his head. You do not understand. Alduin cannot be slain like a lesser dragon. He is beyond our strength. Which is why I brought the Elder Scroll. Feldir, we agreed not to use it. I never agreed. And if you are right, I will not need it. No, we will deal with Alduin ourselves. Hear it now. We shall see soon enough. Alduin approaches. So be it. Me, Tarudis, Ani, him hind palive. Zu Hindan. Let those that watch from Sovngarde envy us this day. Not be in terror. You feel fear for the Ready. first time, worm. I see it in your eyes. Skyrim will be free. Contract her. Be gone, world eater. My words with older bones than your own. We break your perch on this age and send you out. You are banished. I'll do We shout you out for all our endings up to the last. Nikri. You are banished! It worked. You did it. Yes. The World Eater is gone. May the spirits have mercy on our souls. That was kind of epic. Very cool though, I love the effect. It would be really cool if you had a ability that did something similar to that. Just crush an enemy like that. Come on.
There we go. Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, say, I forgot about that. That's about to go. Well, I'm about to redo this. Learn Dragon Ren. Mortal, finite, and temporary. Let's see here. Your voice lashes out at a dragon's very soul, forcing the beast to land. Really helpful when you're coming across those annoying dragons that just don't want to land, so. Boop. Okay. Unlucky Nakip, Silesur. My belly is full of the souls of your fellow mortals, Dovakin. Die now and await your fate in Southern God. Shut up. Come down here. I'll fight you personally. Lost foot, you are too late, Alduin. of my ancient foes, but you are not their equal. Hurt him while he is grounded. Maze Mul, Dovakin. You have become strong. But I am Alduin, firstborn of Akatosh, Malagi Zoklat. I cannot be slain here by you or anyone else. Yeah, 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 now run away with the t your tail between your legs. That's right. You cannot prevail against me. I will not. Where he landed. Hmm. First, I'm gonna talk to Parthenax. He has something to speak for us. Lot Kongrach, you truly have the voice of a Dova. Alduin's allies will think twice after this victory. Yes, one of his allies could tell us. Mat Mahus, but it will not be so easy to convince one of them to betray him. Perhaps the Half Kossayun, the palace in Whiterun, Dragon's Reach. It was originally built to house a captive Dova. A fine place to trap one of Alduin's allies, hmm? Hmm, yes, but your Soom is strong. I do not doubt that you can convince him of the need. Alright, so we have all this done. Now we can actually learn um, some special effects to enhance uh, three of our uh, shouts. So we're going to do that right now. Hmm, I have taught the way of the voice for centuries and the Thum since long before that. But no, Dovakin. Others do not come here to train anymore. Saran, you are the first in over a hundred years. I meditate on the Rotmulag, the words of power. I counsel in their use. It is enough for me. Knowing a word of power is to take its meaning into yourself. Contemplate the meaning of a Rotmulag. You will become closer to that word as it fills your inner self. Will I teach you, Dovakin? What word calls you to deeper understanding? There are three to master. Fus, Fime, and Yol. 
Alright, Foos, as obviously Foos our dog, I'm gonna pause this so he doesn't go out of the conversation, uh, gives you more uh, oomph behind your attacks. Um, if you use a shield bash, it'll be like you using the uh, first word. Same thing with a, so a, so a sword, uh, blocking with a sword and bashing them with that. So, if you want that, you can basically stagger enemies a lot easier. Um, you also get staggered a lot less, which is pretty helpful. Um, Fime is obviously my favorite words, Fime Zigron. Um, basically, it allows your HP to recharge a lot faster when you're in the uh, Become Ethereal state. Really helpful, especially when you're in the middle of a battle and you need your HP back quickly. Just go boop, and all of a sudden you're recharging your HP and they can't hurt you. Uh, Yol basically just increases your firepower, makes the fire stronger. It's nice, I guess, but not really uh, a necessity. So I'm gonna stick with my favorite, fine. Fade in your tongue. Mortals have greater affinity for this word than the dove. Everything mortal fades away in time, but the spirit remains. Ponder the meaning of spirit. Unslad Zee, where mortal flesh may wither and die, the spirit endures. That is fine. Let that meaning fill you, Sum Ark Mora. You will find that your spirit will give you more strength. Alright, we now have uh, Eternal Spirit. Look. One well, of my favorite abilities, see if it actually has it said here. Let's see here. Nope, still not there. It doesn't show up, sadly. Anyway, um... <laughs> surprisingly... Ooh, there are two. Um, there are, uh... Sadly, this, this set is going to be pretty short. Uh, this is it for now, so... Uh... Editing for this one's going to be very freaking easy. Hello and thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and found it helpful. If you'd like to show your support, feel free to leave a like or a comment. And if you really want to show your support, just go to our Facebook channel or our Twitter and like and follow us. Thank you again for watching the video and I hope to see you guys in the next set. Bye!